Seems that new kid Cat might take Ava's title as the late one in the group. Doubt it. The only reason I got here in time is because I thought the plan was to meet here an hour ago. No one's taking anyone's anything. We're only doing this because we need all the help we can get to win the National Steam Speak Challenge. Letting you know who joined our club is just temporary. So, you know who is Cat, right? Who else would it be? I don't know, me? Oh no, you know who is here. Act normal. Acting normal, acting normal. You fix my board? Ready to roll. Hold on a hot sec. We have something to ask you. Are you interested in science and stuff? Yeah. Why? Well, seems that you're pretty okay at computer programming. We're building a self-driving car and plan to enter in a national STEAM speak challenge. The goal is to come up with an invention for 50 years in the future. That's why we're thinking, if you wouldn't mind, perhaps you'd consider... We really need your help. But we want your total commitment. I heard about you. You bailed on the rugby team. The whole entire school went out to watch the home opener. You were a no-show. Yeah, well, something came up. That's okay. Are you in? Uh, no. I'm out. What? Why? If this competition is for an invention 50 years in the future, your idea is a total loser. What do you mean a total loser? <laughs> Look at all the work we've done. Starting over is mathematically foolish. You don't have to start over if you just modified the car. That's ingenious. Many breakthroughs were built off previous work. Galileo's telescope, Marconi's radio, and even Marie Curie discovering radiation. I bet Princess Dressup could think of something. She seems like a real out-of-the-box thinker. Thanks, and I'm actually dressed as Bellator the Brawler. With the strength of Athena! You do you. I have loads of cool ideas. I thought it'd be cool to build a robotic AI best friend. You know, artificial intelligence. So, like an android? That's seriously sci-fi. I'd help make that. No, no, no. We already have best friends. We need something that will make an impact. Change the world for the better. Well, human-robotic partnerships are the frontier of science and technology. Maybe it's not a friend. It could assist with experiments, medical procedures, and even space travel. Sounds like you should just do this project without me. Riley, come on. Remember when we met? You were the first person at the school to treat me like I wasn't totally weird. And that worked out pretty great. So I'll try to be open to this idea, like you're open to me. Where would we even start? Well, I was thinking we could use the base of the car, turn it into a rover so it can operate in different types of terrain. OK, then let's add an arm so it can move around and touch things. <gasps> and we have large-edged weapons. I'm not sure about that last one. No matter what, you're going to need some next level programming for the artificial intelligence. All of you, just stop. If this thing's going to help people, it needs to be interactive. So let's add a touch screen and some voice commands. Now that's a winning project. Let's get to work.